Checkboxes are really cool. They're really data validation of true or false. Here's how to add a checkbox. If you don't have a checkbox yet, we're gonna go to insert checkbox. Pretty simple, right? Let's insert a few rows above. And if we select the entire range and we go insert checkbox, it'll insert the checkbox to all of those selected cells. Really cool, right? I wanna show you one more thing, which is we can create even if we had no checkboxes, and we just wanna add a checkbox to this second row, and in fact, add another row, we can do this with a simple automation. Go up to Extensions, App Script. That will open your App Script editor here. It might not look like this. This is the end result. It's gonna be two lines of code. It's gonna be really cool. That's what it's gonna look like when you open it for the very first time. So let's call this function add checkbox row. And we're going to call two simple things. We're going to do spreadsheet app with a capital S, capital A, get active sheet. We're going to insert a row. And we need to make the index of the row, which is just the row number we want to insert. That's going to be two. That's not A or B. It's one or two or three or four. It's a number. So we're going to insert row at two. Then we're going to do one more thing. So we're going to copy this whole thing and just get this active sheet. We're going to get range. The range is going to be two comma one. That is just saying it's the second row and the first column. And we're going to insert checkboxes. That is it. Command S to save this. You can select it here, add checkbox row, click run. The very first time you do this, you'll have to authorize it. it may take a couple steps, but once it runs, there it is, our checkbox is added. Let me show you one more cool thing. At bettersheets.co slash snippets, we can get this function on open, this custom menu. Let's add that to the top. Not inside this function, but in addition to this function, we're gonna create a function on open. We're gonna call a custom menu. Actually, we're gonna call it automation menu. And we're gonna take this function add checkbox. The second argument here, we're gonna make that the function we're gonna call. But this first argument, this first string where it says automate, we're gonna call this add, hit command S, save this. We can close this now, go back to our sheet, refresh our sheet. And in real time, this is gonna happen up here next to help is gonna be an automation menu. And if we just add checkbox row, run that script, and it'll add a row there. Very cool, you don't have to go to app script anymore to edit this, to use it. Other people can use it if you're creating checkboxes all the time. You can even automate this daily. So let me show you how to do that really quickly. It's gonna be really, really cool. Just go back to App Script and this add checkbox row is the function that we're gonna to have to automate. Over here on the left, triggers. It's gonna take less than 30 seconds. Go to triggers. On the bottom right, add trigger. Which function to run, we're gonna select add checkbox row. From spreadsheet, we're gonna to change to time driven. Instead of hour timer, we're gonna say day timer, and we're gonna run this before we have work, so three to 4 a.m. This will happen only once per day, but it will happen once per day. It'll just insert a row there and add that checkbox item. Click save. It may take a few moments to create this trigger. If you have any errors, they may happen once it starts triggering, but it's only gonna trigger once a day. If you need to delete this, I'll show you how to do that from here. Go to extensions, app script, Go over here on the left, make sure you go to this triggers little clock. Here it'll be a row. You can click on the three dots over here on the right and click there and click delete trigger to get rid of it if you want. But this is how to add a checkbox and how to do it with automations as well. Hope you enjoyed that. If you're looking to get more out of your Google Sheets than you ever have before, learning complicated formulas, formula combinations, and app script, coding and automating your sheets, follow here on Better Sheets on YouTube.